Hi guys, warm welcome you all in today's video of English literature. We are going to cover objective questions on John Milton and friends in this video you will get most important questions related to the life and literary work of John Milton and friends aapke paas time hoga questions mein aapko bataungi and you, and uske saath saath options mein aapko dungi and you have time to go through the right answer of that question after that i will tell you the right and correct option of that question yes friends aapke paas 10 seconds ka time hoga aap us question ka answer de sakte ho through uh, chatting section or comment section and friends uske baad main aapko uska right answer bataungi and if friends agar aap visit kar rahe ho first time is channel pe please do subscribe this channel and also check out the membership details in the description box aapko link available mil jayega membership ka इस चैनल को ज्वाइन करने का जिसमें आपको पीडीएफ्स एंड नोट्स अवेलेबल होंगे इंग्लिश लिटरेचर के आपके अपने सब्जेक्ट्स के अकॉर्डिंग आपके सिलेबस के अकॉर्डिंग एंड प्लीज चेक आउट दैट देयर इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स लेट्स बिगिन ऑब्जेक्टिव क्वेश्चंस ऑन जॉन मेल्टन एंड द वेरी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी हैव हियर दाय सोल वाज लाइक अ स्टार एंड डवेल्ट अपॉन दाउ हैड एस अ वॉइस हु साउंड वाज लाइक a sea like the sea who said and where who said this remark about john milton and in which work he had said this remark and we have option a b c and d these are the options you have to tell the right answer out of these four options and friends go for the right answer aapke paas time hai aap is question ka and this is very famous comment this is very famous quotation about john milton given by the another poet you can say and uh, yes friends now i am going to tell you the right answer the right answer of this question is option a yes friends option a is the correct answer wordsworth has given this comment has given this remark about john milton in his work sonnets on milton me sonnet on milton me jo isme jo unhone sonnet likha hai london and it was published in 1802 it was a sonnet on milton and the title of the sonnet was london 1802 and this was the remark given by william wordsworth great victorian poet worshipper of nature to john milton next question number 2 we have at thy heart the lowliest duties was on herself did lay this line are about milton and who said and where ye bhi lines jo hai milton ko denote ki gayi hai milton ke upar isko comment kiya gaya hai ye unko dedicate ki gayi hai and uh, who had said this you have to tell the right answer out of these four option a b c d we have and uh, go for the right answer and also we have the right answer of this question here option b option b is the right answer and uh, Wordsworth has said this remark about John Milton in his sonnet on London and uh, it was published in 1802 so 1802 mein sonnet published hua hai London Next John question number uh, William Wordsworth we have this remark because was Milton human and given by he must William Wordsworth the best John in Milton. humanity Next, we have Whose another comment question? is this the we have option a b c and d go for the right answer this was the comment Uh, done by a critic and we have here critic in option a b c d these all are critics and they have said remark in one of them had said uh, this remark about john milton and you have to tell the right answer and obvious we have the right answer here of this question option b william j long who had written uh, english literature history of english literature book on that and on milton he had given this remark because milton's human human he must know the best in humanity number fourth we have the spirit of lord is upon us whose line is this we have option a b c d this is very easy question you must go for the right answer and the most of the you have given the right answer yes friends option a is the right answer this remark is said by john milton himself next number 5th we have milton milton published his first poem in 1630 at the age of 22 what was its title a b and c d we have here the option you have to tell the right answer the first poem in 
1630 published by John Milton at the age of 22. What was the title of that poem? A, B, C, D. Out of these four options, we have the right answer here. Option A. On Shakespeare, yes, friends, he had written a poem, composed a poem in 1630 on Shakespeare and this was his first poem. Now, moving on to the next question. Number six question of the video we have here. Before one can write, uh, one can write a literature, which is the expression of the ideal, he must first develop in himself the ideal man, the lofty ideal of Fra Alenglo, Alenglo, who said this remark. We have option A, B, C, and D. Out of these five, four options, we have the correct answer. John Milton himself said this remark about the poet and poetry. Number seven, we have he, a poet, ought to himself to be a true poem. That is the composition and pattern of the best and most honorable things. Who said this remark? Obviously, we have the options A, B, C, D. And uh, this video is about uh, John Milton. Then most of you have given the right answer. But friends, when the questions exam mein puche jate hai, then there is no proper or you can say a specific poet is asked then there is a multiple things and multiple questions asked from multiple sections that's why it is very important to go through these questions and please note down all these questions in your notes with its correct options and the right answer we have here option a john milton said this remark number eight question we have now question number 8 is his style was unconsciously sublime because he lived and thought consciously in the in a sublime atmosphere whose comment is this we have option a b c and d whose comment is this who with uh, one, which one critics had said this about uh, milton and obvious we have the option a b c d and the correct option out of these four is option b William J. Long had said this about John Milton. Number nine, and this is the last question of the video. The ode on the morning of Christ's nativity was begun on. We have option A, B, C, and D. Out of these four options, the right answer is option B. Christmas Day in 1629. It was begun in the uh, Christmas Day, 25th December, 16. 29. So friends, in this video, we have some important questions discussed with John Milton. Pe. And please stay connected with England Zone for the most updated and informative and interesting videos, subject matter on English literature. Thank you very much for watching this.